Well, that's our show. Thanks for watching. We'd also like to thank all the people that helped us put this show together and all the folks in Cherokee who made it possible for us to get on the air. Now, while we'd like to think we're so professional that we always get our lines right, that's not necessarily the case. Take a look. The Oconalofty Indian Village it takes you, is a, mm hmm sure is, just like that. Just outside the mute, they became known as the Cherokee. Bum, bum, bum. Dun, dun, dun. Make a lot of noise, show him you're in charge. What would you do? Oh, I'd not. I'd, I'd, uh, would you I'd really? probably do that. Attempts were made to settle disagreements by drawing up treaty. Efforts were made to settle disagreements. <laughs> I was doing so good. If you're an outdoor enthusiast, there's a couple of hot with Nikki. One is called Mingo Falls with a hammer. That, of course, made get made guess you go to. Now, this is the part where I forget my lines. Got it. Some prominent people in Knoxville picked up on the idea and started raising donations to buy the land. Some um, ba ba then. And this breathtakingly beautiful portion of the eastern United United from the late 1700s and on into the 1800s. If you're looking for a good way to spend an afternoon, you've got to check out a kind of a kind of a from the late 19th century that were found that were that were uh, this historic grist mill built back in 1886 is powered with a water powered turbine thingy. Now if you missed part of our show, fear not. The whole thing is going to start all over again in three, two, one.